Hello, my friends, and welcome. It is Thursday, March 22nd, 2018. I am the Drunk Poker. It is beer time. I love saying beer time, because literally, once we get past like 3 o'clock at work and i got like 4 hours left, I'm already kind of there. But hey, lots of great beers in the fridge, as you guys know from last week's trip. Uh, from our stop on Monday, at one of the breweries I don't go to enough, and I really like, I like the people there, I like the beer, um, Bandit Brewing in Toronto. One of my favorite labels, the Raccoon Face, gives me an excuse to use my Bandit glass. This glass looked good with dark or light beers. It's great. So from them, we picked up the Juice Box Northeastern Pale Ale Series using Equinot and Denali Hops, 5.2%. Uh, it's kind of a New England-style pale ale as opposed to an IPA. It's a discussion for a whole other day. You know what this discussion is for? How much I love beer. I love all kinds of beer. I mean, I'm drinking a lot of IPAs. I really think tonight I might take a break and go into something else. I got a lot of really good. I got some Doppelbox and stuff in the fridge and thinking maybe into that. But uh, this was the one I kind of looked at this morning because everybody goes and says goodbye to their fridge, right? It's not just me. Just, just, never mind. Anyways, so, whoa. Hazy. Hazy, bear. Hazy. And you can literally smell like the orange, the mango, the pineapple. A little bit of grapefruit. You could smell it like it was just wafting. I was like, love it. Cheers, my friends. Cheers to Bandit. Go see them. Like, cool logo. I remember when they first opened, they didn't have any branded glassware, but they had their little tasters, and they had the raccoon, and they were just disappearing like crazy. Don't steal glassware, guys. Pay for your glasses. Come on. Be nice. Cheers. Oh. <laughs> Woo! You know, I started doing the, I mean, I've been doing videos for a while, but I started doing these daily videos um, a couple months ago because I'm like, why not? All right, I'm going to have my first sip of beer anyways. I might as well share with you guys. And I love sharing that first sip, especially if it's really good. And you're just, I'm literally, I've talked about this. It's just like the day just goes away. I don't care anymore about the, the stupid stuff that happened. It doesn't matter because I got a great beer in my glass and I got a whole night ahead of me where I can do whatever the hell I want. And that's pretty awesome. I might have one or two more. I might have this might be my only one. Who knows? Wow. That is nice. That day is way bigger than 5'2". Oh, that's good, guys. Well, I, I, really, like, there's some dank in there, a nice, juicy, pillowy, soft body. That just, that gets me every friggin' time with the New England-style stuff. That kind of pillowy haziness, and it just kind of carries this tan clementine, tangerine, orange, that kind of note with grapefruit, mango, definitely some resinous pine in the back, some dankness. This is a big beer for 5'2". Bandit, I missed you. It's stolen my heart. Cheers, my friends, to Thursday nights, which are Friday nights. Dang it, it's Friday. Holy moly. Wow. I'm not reshooting. I don't give a shit. It's Friday, March 23rd. So my birthday was a week ago. That was a long day at work. Thanks for catching that, Poke. You're welcome, Poke. We've reached the stage in the night where I'm talking to myself. Cheers, my friends. Have a great Friday. I might see you later, maybe tomorrow. I don't know what's going on anymore. Thanks, Bandit. You guys rock. This is really good beer.